Uh, yeah, definitely. I mean, it was kind of tiring at the end, but I mean, to get up and down like that, it's fun. You think they're not great defensive, but you feel like you guys moved it pretty well and kind of did what you guys wanted to do off of um, Yeah, it, we took better shots, you know, open shots, and that's why our assist numbers were high and we were making shots, so. How did going into that game, knowing they jacked up a lot of threes, change your approach? Um, well, we just game plan to, like, switch everything and just – we, I mean, we've seen their film, so we knew they were going to shoot like that. So we just had to play up, and they still hit a lot of shots. So. Hey, it feels like this game is right at hand. You guys never really let up or fell into the trap of playing with swapping. What led to that? Um, I mean, Coach Altman, you know, we're not trying to play salt. But are, you know, you're going to take a seat on the bench. So that's, that's pretty much why. Um, yeah, it's still a work in progress. I mean, we got a tough four games coming up, so we'll see how we are. But I think we're definitely playing better together as a team. So. Is there something specific you think in, the, in this game you guys were really able to build off of? Um, I think we're just playing better team defense. And offensively, our efficiency is going up. So. You guys have about a week off now. What do you want to take care of that kind of time? Uh, can you repeat that? You guys got a week off now. Let's talk about this. Um, uh, well, we got finals, so, you know, we got to take care of that and then uh, practice hard, get back to the gym, work on uh, some of our weaknesses and get ready. Huh? Oh, yeah, it's a very fun style play, especially when you got point guards feeding you the ball. I think uh, Payne had like 13 assists, 12 assists. Uh, you know, Casey was sharing a basketball. Dylan was looking up, and you know, you got your bigs looking for you as well. And it's a it's a great style of playing. We got to get back to that. Um, you know, it's all it's, it's all up to coach, I guess. Uh, you know, he's, he's keeps he keeps on saving it, saving it. Uh, but he's gonna he's gonna let the beast loose soon, you know. So. Uh, and then these guys are really holding, holding the fork, especially, you know, uh, Payne's playing big, uh, Chris is playing big, Jordan's playing big, Cavell's playing well. And, you know, we're just trying to solidify, you know, our depth to be, you know, more confident so when they come in against, you know, big teams in the Pac-12, you know, they ain't, they ain't scared and they ain't shook. How are you feeling? Hey, real quick, see if we have anything else for Payton. Let him boss radio real quick. Okay, thanks. Continue right. along with Dylan. Yeah, uh, you know, we shaped up a couple of kinks and we're trying to focus in on details like, you know, not turning over the basketball and, you know, making plays for our teammates and rebounding the basketball a little bit better. And I think over time and, you know, this week especially, we're going to get a lot better in it because we know what we got next. Uh, you know, tough teams like Alabama, UNLV, and then three weeks away from Pac-12. So we know we've got ahead and, you know, we got to prepare like how we prepared for, you know, elite, elite eight games and games in the March Madness. I'm almost there. Um, you know, I'm trying to get back in shape a little bit more. Uh, coach let me practice, you know, throughout the whole whole practice, you know, give me full practices. And, you know, it's just almost there. And, uh, you know, I feel good. And my teammates keep pushing me to, you know, go harder and push harder. And, you know, it's it feels it feels great. Yeah, uh, we, I think we are, and, you know, we're going to have a test uh, like every team has, and I think we're going to, you know, sur surpass those tests and, uh, you know, grow as a team and, you know, really have fun this season. You guys had, like, 82 points in the paint, 67 rebounds. Obviously, you had the size advantage. you feel like going in there that those are going to be some numbers you guys can put up? Yeah, uh, you, know, you know, killing them on the boards and, you know, sharing the basketball. Uh, if you know if you play the exact same as you know your opponent does, you fall into the same uh, miss errors and stuff like that. Uh, you know we kept you know our our heads on straight and you know we played our game and that's why we scored like 120 points. Oh, I thought he was gonna windmill, honestly, <laughs> but off the glass is is crazy. Is it tough for you come back? Is it getting kind of in a routine on the court? I mean, you feel 
feel physically your back, but it's just sort of kind of getting your. Yeah, uh, you know, I feel I feel physically good. Uh, you know, uh, I gotta work on my threes a little bit more. Uh, just feeling more confident and stepping into them, and I'll come over time and practice and. You know, guys giving me confidence in to take those shots. And especially if we got a roll going like that, you know, you just let everything fly and it feels good. Um, you know, just really focusing on details, like we have fifteen turnovers and we don't we, we don't want that mark. We wanna get lower, uh at least like eleven. Uh to show, you know, we're still aggressive. You know, beating them on the boards and we did. Uh, you know, feeding Feeding guys who are hot and you know finding the open shooter with Tyler, he almost had 30 points and he was really shooting it. And you know just getting getting in uh, in a rhythm and you know getting used to guys. You know uh, we haven't played with Peyton or Cavell or on none of the new guys, so we're just trying to mix in and see what different lineups we can have and what lineups work. And you know a lot of them were working and a lot of them and coach you know has got to play with it. You know, like I said, throughout my freshman year, he's like a master at this game, and he just places different um, pieces anywhere, and he just lets it go, and somehow, you know, it works. So uh, we just want to play hard for him, and you know, just keep the role going. Um, you know, I see a lot of confidence and, you know, he's trying to run the team like, you know, all the rest of the point guards did in, in the past. Uh, he's really pat he's really looking for guys and, uh, you know, he could score it too. Uh, he's got a nice three point stroke and, uh, you know, that's, that's a lot of things that, you know, guys don't know about Payne. He can, and he's a little, he's a little bulldog in there as well. He doesn't, he doesn't like to get his, his, uh, feet wet. Anything else? <laughs> Do you want Tyler kind of Um, we were just feeding off each other's, uh, you know, each other's scoring. I guess we're having a little competition. Uh, but, um, you know, he was just scoring and, you know, I wanted to score and it got a lot of guys into it. Uh, and, you know, Tyler, he set the tone from the, from the jump, you know, hitting his first three shots. And, you know, he played and he started playing defense a little harder. And, you know, that's what we need from guys, you know, playing harder on defense and, you know, taking confident, confidence in their shot. Oh, yeah, all the time, you know, me and Tyler uh, and Chris all the time, you know, we always talk about it. Uh, but, you know, we know what tasks is at hand and, you know, we focus in and try to do it within the system. Okay. Thanks, Thank you.